So, um, just to start, could you tell me, introduce yourself and your business in like two, three sentences? Okay, hi, my name is Brad Hills and this is my shop, People's Records, here in Midtown. Okay, um, and how'd you get started? Um, I opened up in 2003 in the basement of the Forest Arms Apartments uh, with a friend who wanted to sell uh, vintage furniture and clothing. Okay. And so uh, she got into real estate instead, and then the records kind of took over after that. All right. Um, and then why did you choose, you know, Detroit to, to begin with versus another location, say in the suburbs or just another city? Well, the music that I'm interested in is from the city and not from the suburbs as much. I'm trying to find jazz and R&B. A lot of other shops focus on rock more or indie stuff. And we're looking more for jazz and R&B. Okay. All right. Um, so what have some of the challenges been, you know, owning and running a business in the city um, that you've had? We, we went through a, a big fire back in 2008 where our store was... Uh, it's submerged in water. <laughs> the forest arms apartments burnt down. Yeah. So that was tough. We've relocated a couple times. So uh -huh. just uh, finding affordable rent in Midtown is the biggest challenge. The prices keep going up. You know, things are getting more expensive before it really seems to make sense to me. We keep getting squeezed out of every place we move into. So, okay. you know. All right. Um, so would you say like the Detroit name just impacts your business at all or? Mm, well, there's a great deal of tourism because of music. People visit Detroit from all over the world because of the history of music here. So being here helps a lot. I mean, today we had three, three people that seemed like they might have been from Germany. You okay. know, another week it might be people from Japan or England or anywhere around the world you can think of. Um, there were some guys from, a group of guys from Kuwait yesterday. Wow. So, I mean, people come from all over kind of, that are, you know, music fans, and so they want to take yeah. some music home with them. Okay, all right. Um, so, would, do you have any advice that you think someone moving a business or opening a business in the city should know? I don't have any, any I don't know, any wisdom there, I guess. It's, it's, it's pretty tough. Having a small business is tough. Okay. <laughs> all right, well, I appreciate your time. And